Hello, hello. Welcome, everyone, to another EVJ Live podcast. Today I have a special guest with us. This is Dennis from Hardware Asylum. Right. Hello, everyone. Yeah, so first of all, thanks for coming on our show. You're welcome. It's always great to have all enthusiasts from all walks of life join our show. Yes. So um, <clears throat> Hardware Asylum is a review website. You review hardware. Yeah, hardware. Clocking. Yeah, it's uh, motherboards, video cards, cases, coolers. We do a lot with cooling. We've been getting into doing uh, keyboards and mice, in which EVJ has a great mouse. And yeah, we have one right here. <laughs> and some headphones. <laughs> but I have a unique focus in that it's enthusiast level hardware, so it's focused mostly on uh, the overclocking aspect and what you can do and tweak the system to get the best performance. And we love overclocking. LN2 is the best. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so he's one. Of the, he's pre, he's pretty unique in that regard. That he actually will test it on liquid nitrogen cooling, which mm -hmm. not a lot of guys are, are doing. Actually, um, we were just talking that you we, we sent you an X299 dark board. So yep. I'm looking forward to seeing what you can get on that one. Yeah, I have two processors. I'm going to test on it. Um, probably one on phase and the other one on LN2. Uh, but first impressions, I really like the board. Uh, the fact that it has LED lights all over the place. Uh, to give you status, you know, when you have a video card plugged in, it actually lights up a green light. LED uh, lights that aren't just RGB. <laughs> right, exactly. That they show you some actual useful information, yeah. which is cool and to see. The board itself is heavy. It has some weight to it, which is a testament to the thickness of the PCB, how stiff it is, and also the cooling aspect of it. It's got a lot of metal on there to keep it cool. Yep. And yeah, it has a lot. It has a pretty beefy heat sink, I'm sure you've noticed. Uh -huh. Even on the back of the board, I mean... We really went to all extents to make sure that the VRM is cooled properly. Yep. Um, so I guess we can start off, since you're the new guest on the show, we can start off with the most important question that I'm sure is on most people's minds is, do you like hot dogs? I do like hot dogs. Okay. I'm, uh, uh, you can come back. <laughs> all right. Awesome. Yeah, actually, uh, Costco hot dogs. Those big beefy. Okay. Yes. Yeah, I've I heard like those. those are very good. Um, I'm also... Uh, not really an Oscar Mayer guy, more of like the, the, the spicy sausage sort of hot dog guy, you know? Okay, I can, yes, I can see that. <laughs> All right, cool. So, there yeah. we go. We got that out of the way. Yeah. There you guys go. Now you know. <laughs> yeah, I know. You also love Pepsi. Yes, I do. <clears throat> so, anytime I ever see Dennis here, he's always asking me for a Pepsi. Thankfully, we found we found one just for him. So yeah. thank you very much. Yeah. Now I can come back. <clears throat> do you drink Coke, too, or are you just Pepsi? I drink Coke when I have to, but a lot of times if I go to a restaurant that serves Coke, I'll say, um, how about a beer or water? Do you like SLI? I mean, come on, that's a given. Everybody yeah, SLI. SLI. Four-way the best. Yes. SLI hot dogs even? Well, not quite as good, but no. almost. <laughs> so, um, so anyways, thanks again, uh, EBJ, or thanks again, everyone, for joining the EBJ Live podcast or it's now it's called like weekly or something i can't yeah, i can't with remember. the weekly with jacob i, I guess so, right? what i saw yeah. okay that's what it's called so mm -hmm. that's what you're watching right now <laughs> <laughs> so uh a couple things that uh, we can talk about before we get to oh wait hold on uh oh hold your hot dogs i just made that up yeah <laughs> that was a good one uh <clears throat> so we're going to give away this motherboard right here this is a z270 ftwk motherboard so he did review this one, but he re you reviewed the Classified K. I did. Yep, which uh, is also another awesome board. Mm -hmm. So the Z270 FTWK, we're going to give away on this very live stream that you are watching right now or listening to. Could be. Whichever one it is. Whichever one. On the Maybe both. four channels that you're mm -hmm. broadcasting to, or is it five? Mixer, Twitch, YouTube, Facebook. Four. Four. So no matter what platform you're watching on, you have an equal chance to win. <laughs> <coughs> so I, I say this every time, but just in case you're new here, you're a newbie. It's okay. <laughs> we like noobs. I'm a noob. I've seen a few noobs. PUBG. In yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a PUBG noob. Have you been? So I retired from PUBG, if you haven't noticed. I, or if you haven't known. I watched that stream okay. where you got retired. Yeah. <laughs> it was fun. Yeah. So <laughs> I can no longer play PUBG. I've been banned. Been the PC gaming gods have banned me from PUBG, <laughs> and I haven't. I've stayed true to my word. I have not touched PUBG since that very day. Um, so, anyways, if you aren't familiar with how to win, we will have a secret word, and we will tell you what that secret word is later on in the show, and then we will give away stuff. That's how it works. Chat's going crazy today. A lot of, a lot of SLI and a lot of hot dogs going on. That's, that's good. 
<clears throat> we want you all. <laughs> yeah. So, my my I, I didn't actually get banned from PUBG. I kind of banned myself from PUBG. Yeah. All right. So before we get to uh, any of that stuff, let's talk about some of the stuff that's going on. So uh, first of all, this is your website, HardwareAsylum.com. Does plenty of reviews. You also have a weekly, bi-weekly podcast, right? Yes. So uh, make sure to check that out if uh, you know if you want to yeah. listen about the latest and greatest in hardware or overclocking or. As it says, it's the number one podcast for computer hardware enthusiasts. Yep. We talk about just about everything computer related. Um, so the show is recorded once a month and then we release it twice. So the main show comes out on the 10th and then we have an extra that comes out on the 24th. The extra is more of a raw look into just some topic that happens to be in on our minds. And the latest one is about headphones. Headphones make the game. And we kind of talk about the different levels of headphones and the cost of entry and where you really need to be if you want a good quality headphone. Uh, one before that, we were talking about uh, Battlefield and the Zotac GTX 1070 Ti. Sorry, it wasn't an EVGA <laughs> product that time. But we do have no, some yeah. EVGA topics that we've, you know, if you go in the backlog, we've talked about. Mr. Hardware Asylum, favorite air cooler and favorite AIO? Mm. Favorite air cooler would be the thermal right. Are you? Oh, this guy. Wait, before we get oh, to that. Okay. Are you? Are you all even kid friendly? I think so. Mm -hmm. yes. yes. For now. For now. <laughs> <laughs> Up to this point, yes. Yeah. Uh, so air cooler. Favorite air cooler was the thermal right Venomous X. It's an old cooler, but very solid, very good. And the AIO. I'm an Asetek fan. EVGA CLC 280. There you go. Oh, There's sorry. your answer. Ace attack. <laughs> yeah, Ace attack. Actually, I have one right here. Maybe if something happens cool later, like I get a kill on something, we'll give this away too. Awesome. A, a few weeks ago, um, we had one of the sales guys playing, and he's like a PUBG master, and he got like four or five kills, and we ended up giving away four or five CLC. So you never know <laughs> what could happen on this show. <laughs> yep. Um, so, yeah, that's, uh, that, that's it. I'll put the link in the chat. So Hardware Asylum, make sure to check it out for... The latest, the latest and whatever. Pepsi, I, your Pepsi's blocking my oh, chat. Let me get that <laughs> yeah. out of there here. All right, so there you go, hardwareasylum.com. Uh, we also talked about the X299 Dark. He just got one in like a couple days ago, right? Yeah. So uh, he's going to be putting it through its paces. Mm -hmm. Of course, that's the board right there. It was, yeah, it's awesome. I like the cutouts in the PCB too. Yeah, actually, I, that, that, uh, that's really cool. I really like that feature a lot. It helps a lot with fitting it into chassis that may not be able to fit a normal Well, it's, it's wider. E ATX. Yeah, it's wider yeah. than most normal boards. And with the location of where the cable routing channels are, it would be a bit <laughs> of a turn. Here goes Jacob and his linking skills. I think that one worked. It did. It's highlighted and everything. Yeah. Oh, wait, no, that's from someone else. <laughs> yeah, that's not, that's the wrong URL. <laughs> um, did mine work? Yeah, yep. looks like it did. Yeah, it did. All right, so that is that. Um, I don't want to watch bad word streams. No bad words here yet. Mm -mm. <clears throat> um, and then this is actually something really cool that I wanted to show. So our friends over from Modders Inc. Uh, who do a lot of case mods. I think you you know mm -hmm. some of the guys there. Yep. They took our DG8 Seven. DG87 case. Mm -hmm. It's a big full... You've seen... Yeah, I have one. Yeah, he has one. A big full tower case. And he turned it into a jukebox. Complete with turntables. Complete. Check this out. Maybe not a microphone. <laughs> Does that actually work? <laughs> <laughs> Be nice if it did. Like that'd be cool if the fan like spun the turntable or something. Mm-hmm. Uh, so complete with turntables on there. This is what it looks like. Check that out. It's even water cool. So obviously. it has Leisure Suit Larry, Doom, Wolfenstein Descent, Duke Nukem 3D, Need for Speed, Unreal, and Age of Empires. <laughs> Those are your song options. Hmm. Oh, and they left the the um, control panel intact. Yeah, this part right here. Mm -hmm. So. Oh, how did you masterfully get banned from PUBG again? Stream code. I did. It was a lack of kills. No, it's it's it was myself banning. It was oh. it was me banning myself from the game because I'm so bad at it, basically. Yeah. Um. So that's yeah. Modern thing. Check it out. I'll put a link in the chat. 
Also, this one is... Oh, you're only move that out of the way again. Yep, Pepsi in the way. <laughs> so, I put that in the chat. That link that, may, have or may, have, may or may have... May or may not have worked. Maybe it's the HTTPS that doesn't work. Um, no, it worked. No, see, it put the dot, dot, dot. Oh, dot. no, it's too long. The dot, dot, dot is... Yeah, I know, long. but... I have to use a URL shortener or something? <laughs> yeah, it does. Sometimes if I take the HTTPS, I put it on. All right, hold on. I'm trying, guys. I'm trying. <laughs> that worked. Wait, did that work? Put know. that up there. Anyway, the Tap Modders Inc. Make sure to check it out. Really cool case mod from them. Complete with turntables. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. So, uh, this is also another pretty cool case mod, if you want to call it that. So, this is a tiny little tiny. system. Small. <laughs> with two. NVIDIA GeForce USB thumb drives in RAID 0. Yeah. It's so, a Raspberry Pi, it looks It's a like. Raspberry Pi, right, with yep. two NVIDIA GeForce USB drives running in RAID 0. So it's like, maybe like that big. Mm -hmm. That's really awesome. And there's an EVGA in the background. Yeah. I think that's a shirt. Why don't you look at that? Or that that actually might be a tablecloth or something. Ooh. I'm not 100% sure. Oh, that actually, that might be a shirt. Could be. I don't know. That's all speculation at this point. <laughs> maybe. Maybe not. Maybe. I don't know. So that is pretty cool. And then I did want to mention that there is a deal on the EVJ Supernova G3 power supply over at Newegg for $99 after rebate. So if you're in the market for an EVJ G3 power supply, make sure to check it out. By the way, if you're in the market for <coughs> um, 10 series cars, there was some stock put up earlier today at EVG.com. And of course, we also have the bundles going on at EVG.com so you can get an EVG 10 series, 1080 Ti, or 1080, 1070, 1060, I think is up there too, with a motherboard or a CLC cooler, and you can actually get a pretty decent savings on top of it, so you can get it below MSRP. Hmm. All right, and then last but not least, we have two new drivers released. So we have the 39.01 Wickle drivers that were released by NVIDIA on February 26th, that was Monday. So this was for Final Fantasy, uh, PUBG, which I'm banned from, so <laughs> I'll never know how it performs in PUBG. Uh, Warhammer Vermintide 2, which we may or may not play later, <laughs> and World of Tanks. Do you play any of those? No. All of them? Hmm. No PUBG? No. I Really? <clears throat> when uh, PUBG was first released, it was a third-person game, and I, yeah. I'm terrible at third-person. I like the first-person mode better. Oh, yeah. uh, I liked past tense. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> first-person mode in PUBG yeah. uh, better than a third person. I don't know. To me, it's more natural. But I'm, I'm terrible at both of them. Yeah. But uh, have you played uh, Fortnite at all? Another third person game. It's another third person <laughs> game. <laughs> yeah. Now, the, the last game that I'm still playing is actually Seven Days to Die. Which is... Um, you were talking about that earlier. Yeah, it was. it's a fun crafting zombie horde game where you have basically seven days to defend yourself from a horde of zombies. So you can... <laughs> build you can actually craft and build um, all the way up to like reinforced concrete and stainless steel it's actually pretty cool um, you can build weapons um, it's easier to find them obviously or buy them but uh, it's, it's a fun game it's challenging because it's basically tower defense so you build a build your fort and all your defenses and see if it lasts against the horde so it's a tower defense game then right? in a sense it's a tower defense game but it has crafting so it's a bit like minecraft um, and then zombies, which again is like Minecraft, but then um, the zombies interact a lot like um, Dying Light, to where at night they get really, really fast and more powerful. Just Thomas says, Jacob, can I ask something? You can ask anything. I can't guarantee you that I can answer it, but you can ask it. Him on the left looks like my science teacher. Hmm. Maybe it is. <laughs> Who's on the left? Oh, that'd be you. <laughs> that would be me yeah i think so yeah <clears throat> um what is your favorite liquid cpu cooler that we talked about that already mm -hmm. although i am a uh, diy sort of builder when it comes to liquid cooling so for that i'm using uh well, just about anything really because yeah. you put it together you buy your parts and you mm -hmm. assemble it yeah so, so do you have a if we're talking about diy water cooling do you have a specific water block that you yeah, I, I've been using the, the heat killer. Okay. I like that one a lot. Yeah. It's solid metal. Um, really nice channel design. 
The uh, Danger Den M6 was probably my favorite water block in the past, though. That was the last big water block that Danger Den had created. Mm -hmm. and it's, you still have one? Yep, I still have <laughs> one. And it is probably the best water Can it still block. fit on current uh -huh. CPUs, platforms? Mm -hmm. The mounting still can well, fit? Well, as we know, the, the mounting didn't change from X79, X99. Right, yeah. And then for X150 or 11.5X, it's still the same. So. Mm -hmm. so, yes. Although I had to uh, build my own mounting to make that work because. The, the screws they sent me was just for X99. So. Mm. What water cooler? Pour water on your console and you're good to go. I don't recommend that. Mm -mm. Never recommend pouring water on your console. All right, so with that, so let's see if our 360 camera's working today. I, 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 we were in the middle of streaming it and I turned it on. <laughs> I forgot to turn it on today. Looks like it's working. I think so. I got a nice fish eye going on. Yeah, so this the main purpose of this camera was to use it at um, shows. Mm -hmm. like oh, so you could see people come around. Yeah. cam type of thing. So in, a, in an area such as this, it's probably not as useful. But uh, yeah, you can see the green screens are really uh, no. <laughs> pretty cool. Yeah. I, I did watch the 360 cam when you were broadcasting at PAX once. And you, know, you get a lot of people that are oblivious to the fact that this little block is a camera. Yeah. <laughs> Just kind of stand there. Oh, what's going on? Where do you get EVJ stickers? So those stickers actually came in, um, comes with EVJ laptops. Oopsie can is yep. new. Yeah. So last week we did a find something new and then you can win something. But the Pepsi can is not the item this time. <clears throat> Sorry. Not the item. <laughs> um, all right. So that is... Kind of oh, it. you had uh, hot fix? Hmm? Hot fix? Oh, I forgot. So th there was a second driver release. <laughs> this one was like yesterday. Um, yesterday? What was today? Yes, yesterday. Yep. So 391.05, this is a hot fix driver. So that means it's, I don't think, it's probably not Wickel certified. It's kind of intended only to, only if you have these very specific issues. So uh, NVIDIA Freestyle stopped working issue, display corruption on Titan V, GPU, and added support for Microsoft Surface Book Notebook. So if you don't have any of those issues, you probably don't need this driver, but it is the latest driver, 391.05. I don't think many people have a Titan V. <clears throat> it could be wrong. Uh, well, Vince has a few of them. Kingpin. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> he likes messing with those, that's for sure. Yeah. But uh, it's only, for if we're talking about world records, there's no SLI support. So it's it'll allow you to achieve the fast, the highest 30 mark world record single card. Yeah. But uh, if you want to do multi-GPU, you still want the 1080 Ti on there. We're almost <laughs> at uh, Devil SLI. Mm -hmm. What's that? We're almost at Devil SLI. Oh, yeah. Well, look at that. Almost there. 658. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, so uh, so now it's time for the moment that a lot of you've been waiting for. EVJ.com forward slash live giveaway. Go there. The secret <laughs> word is asylum, right? Yep. Yeah. So yep. let me put that in the chat. Part of the name, right? Make now. sure you spell us right. All right, so EVJ.com forward slash live giveaway. Secret word is A S Y L U M. Is that right? Yep. That yes. is right. Okay. So All right, I'm going to give you guys one more chance here. One more. There is a special, there is something different in our 360 camera. Oh, yeah, I'm going to bring that one up again. And if the first person who can spot it will give us CLC cooler. Okay. I don't know, maybe somebody spotted it already. I didn't notice anyone spotting it, but it's really hard to see. I'm going to warn you right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty small, and can we give hints? Uh, oh, wait, no, no hints. It's not a head crab. No, it's not the blue dude. It's not the Pepsi can. It's not the. It's not the head crab. We already said that. It's not <laughs> the controller. How long has the blue dude been here? A long time. So <laughs> oh no, actually no. Well, he's always been around here. Okay. Oh my gosh, it's going too fast. Orange. The cap. red cable <laughs> on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, clamp. No. Uh, nope. Clamp on the table, no. Dice, there's dice? There is? I don't know, there's dice here. Carpet, the new guy. <laughs> yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm new. 
Not the backwards poster. Yes, the secret word is asylum. The thing on the head crab. Okay, who is that? Flip, flip, something. Okay, that, yeah, that's close enough. So, okay, so it's this is uh, the Szechuan sauce. Look at that. Szechuan. That's the secret item. <laughs> For McDonald's. Yeah, so this is the... You know, we had an idea to, to, to eat a, a hot dog with this stuff. On stream? On stream, but we forgot about the hot dog, so... Oh. So, who said that? Um, well, I don't know. It's moving. I guess I could scroll, huh? I, t <laughs> I don't know. Um, hey, somebody recognized me. Oh, here it is. Flip, flip. One, two, three. All right. Flip, flip. One, two, three. Where is that? Flip, flip, flip. That was the first one that I noticed who got it. Mm. Flip, flip. One, two, three. <clears throat> Drink that sauce for breakfast. No. All right. Flip, flip. One, two, three. You've won an EVJ CLC 280. For recognizing the new object on our 360. We need to come up with like a name for this giveaway or game. Oh, the Find Something New game? Yeah. Um, FSN? Find Something New. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Maybe. I'll get Look and find with EVGA. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that's appropriate. Please test if Szechuan sauce is an adequate thermal paste alternative. Hmm. Maybe. You know, the guys from Overclock TV, they tried mustard. Yeah. By the way, the Overclock TV guys, I think I saw them in the chat. I think they're watching. It's <laughs> still on the card, by the way. So <laughs> we could still try it to this day. We haven't changed it yet. It's still in the box. Yeah, we did a 79, 7950 GX2. <laughs> with uh, mustard. With mustard. Now with extra mustard. Actually, they're in um, episode 60 of my podcast, at the very end, we had... Uh, Darren had come up with a new way to cool a computer that was better than a heat pipe. That's what he called it. But it was nacho cheese. It's yeah, kind of fun. Yeah, that'll work. Yep. <laughs> nacho cheese. All right. So in case you guys missed it, evj.com forward slash live giveaway. The secret word is asylum. So put that secret word in, and we will give away an evj Z270 FTW K motherboard to one random person. And we already gave away a CLC 280 to Flip Flip 123 for spotting the secret Szechuan sauce. Oh, they gotta which, put it back. Which we may or may not eat later. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> All right, so, uh, so now it's time to play some stuff. Okay, so some people were talking about this last time. So I just got it. Let's see, let's go get it here so what I have is Warhammer Vermintide 2 hmm. which I hear I haven't played it I just like literally installed it which I hear is pretty much like Left 4 Dead with melee weapons hmm. so we'll see how that is but it's a Warhammer game so it's probably third person first person ah shark <laughs> yep shark shark Left shark. Do we have sound? Is there sound in here? Um, loads and loads and there loads and loads. There can be no victory. Oh. Okay. All right. <clears throat> so this is Warhammer Vermintide 2. So first of all, let me show you what settings we're running at here. So we're running 4K. 4k um, I, I did kind of set some of the settings before we came on here so basically I set extreme graphics quality but I just turned off motion blur no are you a motion blur fan no okay I don't think I've ever felt found anyone who is <laughs> so um, basically everything else is set to the extreme level it does have a setting here for um, max shadow casting lights but I haven't I didn't play around with this maybe we can try that <laughs> later See you out if it looks bad. All right, so oh, this is first person. Yes, Sweet. it is first person. So this is Warhammer Vermintide 2, which, like I said, is supposedly like Left 4 Dead 2 or Left 4 Dead 1. <clears throat> what is the secret word today? The secret word is asylum. What was the web address? EVGA.com <laughs> forward slash live giveaway. All right, so we're going to do recruit because I've never played this in my life. Oh, we start easy. So now it's finding a game, I think. 
What's the secret word we just said? <clears throat> uh, the secret word is asylum. Oh, there we go. Grumby is on it. <clears throat> yep, you got it. So what happened? Did it find a match or something? Um, oh, it says joining game. Oh. Well, it is beta. Yeah, that? so this is a beta. I think it comes out next week. It's that guy that looks like he's at a workbench. Huh? I don't know. I, I, this is like the main hub. Oops. Uh-oh. I think it started already. Oops. Yep, joining game. <laughs> Somebody said grow up. My Nana can beat Recruit. Yeah. Okay, well we can try. Let's try this first. I don't know. <laughs> We've seen my PUBG skills. <clears throat> Is this game multiplayer only? That I do not know. So what do I have here? So I got a sword. What is this thing? I think you're in a training mode. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> you got a rocket launcher. Is that a rocket launcher? Oh, it looks like it. Or just. Blunderbuss is probably what it is. Is that my teammate? I'm out. I'm out. Okay, these are my teammates. Mm -hmm. So where do I need to go then? Just follow them, just like Left 4 Dead? Yeah. Or go wherever the bullets are not coming from. So we're getting around 100 frames per second at 4K, which is actually pretty good. I don't know. Does anyone know what game engine this uses? This gun takes forever to reload. It's an old muzzle loader, of course. Oh, probably I can shoot it and then switch to. Yep. Yeah. Switch the pistol, always, right? Oh, there you go. Okay, that works. So this guy's glowing blue. Does that mean he's like a boss or something? Maybe. Whoa. The arm. <laughs> so much gore. I haven't died yet. It's like a hand cannon. Hand cannon. It's a big pistol. You can play this in single player, but the bots are liability more often than not. Stick with the cannon attached. So what yes. else do I got? Do I have any other? Nope, you have two things. Oh, how'd that work? Luck. It's like the drop reload. <laughs> what? Fast. Oh. Do I have a grenade? Um, did I run out of bullets? Yes. <laughs> okay. Can't tell, but it looks like you did. So I need to find more bullets. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, there's a horde. Alright, I'm running out of here. A grenade will come in handy right now. Mm -hmm. The sword is doing pretty well though. There we go. Run away brave. Run away bravely. Any work on EVJ precision. I'm not sure what you mean by that. That was more LED support. Okay. You got a purple bar there that means something. Yeah. Whoops. <laughs> did I just waste that? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know what that did. <laughs> Seemed like some sort of power up that I wasted. He'll be back. You gotta find a key to the barn. Okay. So this is very much like Left 4 Dead. Yeah. Which is cool. There's not too many games. Co-op style games like this. Hmm. There's double sound. Yeah, it's because the... Microphone. The TV, yeah, the mic is picking up the audio. You have to hear what's going on. Now what do I do? Oh. What's this? So, can I see how much lives I have? Is that the green bar? I think it's uh, in the upper left. <laughs> oh no, it's the green bar on the bottom. Okay. The head crowd's blocking it. 
Didn't you have the head crab on the microphone at one point? Yeah, some people said that it... What does this do? What is this? That looks like dynamite or something. Can I throw it? Oh. oh, it's just something heavy you can throw. So... Is this oh, oh, geez. I still don't... Can I throw it at that guy? Yeah. Oh, you missed I need bullets. Bullets. Which your meat's left for dead. Kind of. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, wow. Yes, it is vermicide, right? Yes. So, what do you think? Would you play? I think did I play, Did you play much Left 4 Dead? I never played Left 4 Dead, no. I probably, you know. But. I played a lot of Left 4 Dead. Not as much Left 4 Dead 2, but Left 4 Dead 1. So, I'm like blinking red. And yep, 0 out of 0. Making more bullets. That like barely did any damage to him. So his so he has his health bar up there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a little bit less than half right now. I but when I hit him, it took like not much off. <laughs> no. That's how they make the boss fights last night. Yeah, I guess so. Uh -oh, so what happens? Um, tractor beam. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hit the little guy in his back and just said, "Is that the trick?" Mm -hmm. Seems to be a weak point on a lot of uh, characters. Oh, hit the weak point for maximum damage. <laughs> Find that ladder sideways. I thought that was kind of fun. Yeah. Oh yeah, the little guy. That's oh, probably the weak point. You know yeah, he's almost dead. Can I help him? Yes, yep. I can. Yeah, look at me being a good teammate. Okay. Yay, we won. <laughs> Alright, in, in case you guys missed it, evj.com forward slash live giveaway. The secret word is asylum. We're giving away an EVJ Z270 FTW K motherboard. Alright, unlock and go through the barn. Isn't that over here? Uh, yes, and what it's open. That? So well, he broke it open. Yeah. I didn't really unlock anything. And it will do so again. Uh, there's lots of death in here. Well, you think doomed? <laughs> I do. That guy was busy. If the dark gods build energy, you won't foolish. He was hungry. <laughs> yeah, he's hungry. Oops. I can't take much more, darling. Love it when they say asylum. Your life is all but spent with oh, that's <laughs> his name. Uh, I just got that. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, here's where we have to go, I think. We're just going out the top of the park. Seems like a waste. You should be able to just go around the barn. Can I do any, like, secret moves with my sword if I, like, hold it down or something? Mm -hmm. yeah. It kind of seemed like you did a bar move, right? Wait, did anyone answer what game engine this uses? I did not notice. I don't know what. I'm curious. So it does support DirectX 12. That was actually one of the options that you can select when you first start the game, mm -hmm. which is always good to see. <laughs> I'm leaving all my friends. No, they're just being slow. Very nice lighting effects. Mm -hmm. This day they need to wear all green so they're just floating heads. We did that, at, actually I did that on Halloween. That was my Halloween costume. You could have done the uh, the green hood and then it would be just a body. It would be the, the headless yeah, Jacob. that would be good. Whoa! Oh my goodness. Uh oh. Am I dead? Uh, I think you are. Okay. Although that purple bar is up again. I'm dead. So 
Somebody save me. Look at us. There you go. Teamwork and everything. There's no I in team. <laughs> but there is a me. There is a me. <laughs> All about me. Not a pretty job, but it'll hold. Clicking and clicking. Hmm. Did I find any? Ah, uh, there's a lot of these guys. So where do we find more bullets? Maybe someone in chat knows. Does anyone know where we can find more bullets? Please tell us. <clears throat> can you actually like pick up other weapons? I haven't seen any other weapons. I saw somebody throw a grenade once. It was just a fireball. Yep. Yeah. Think gun shop. Yes. A gun shop. Yeah. We'll just go to Kmart and pick up some more bullets. That works. Bullet store. So how long are each of these levels? And I'm kind of curious, do they play out the same? So you remember with Left 4 Dead... There you go. Fire bumps. Or potions or something. Is that what I needed to reload? Uh, no. If, if you remember for Left 4 Dead, every time you played it, it was like a little bit different. Like the zombies would come out of different places, or there'd be a different boss in some location. I'm kind of curious if this is, is similar in that way. Enemy spawns are random, somebody said. Oh. It seems very, uh, click a button and then all of a sudden a bunch of zombies come out, so... Or, no, zombies, but... Enemies. Oh, yes! Sweet! Ammunition's full. There you go. And you can have a maximum of 12. So I only have 12. That's balance. Yeah. <laughs> Levels are around 12 to 25 minutes depending on difficulty and group. Okay. Right click to block. Good to know. Already equipped. Already equipped. It must be three and four. Oh, the purple bar is up, so next time you get attacked, maybe hit whatever. What's this do? Ooh, rescue. Did I do this? But you gotta free any prisoners in the barn. Okay, I did it. Right up there in the barn. Oh, oh, inside the barn. Whoops, I'm glad. Whoa. So, so does this guy have a weak point too? <laughs> All right, you ready to play? Me? Yeah. Uh, go for it. W A S D. Oh, oh crap! You're inverted. I'm one of those. Yeah. Oh, so you played the other way, but the, the down is up and up is down. Really? Yes. People may think it's lame, but <laughs> it's all about what you get used to. You know, I actually used to play like that a long time ago, and then at some point I got used to the. Oh, they grab tradition. Kill them all. I'm gonna say death. I um, I blame it on Mech Warrior. The name of the game is Warhammer 2, Warhammer Vermintide, right? Vermicide. Vermicide. That's right. Yeah. 
So it's easier environment, I guess. <laughs> Hey, what do you have on her leftovers? Yes. What? What the fuck are? Oh, are we off camera? <laughs> no, I don't. There's like that's like the wall, I think. Oh, oops. what? What? Why is that doing that? That's weird. Uh oh. Yeah, I'm not good. I don't. I have no idea what that thing is on the lower left-hand corner. Oh, someone save me. That's on your side over here. Yep. Ah. Weird. <coughs> oh, what was that? Somebody revived you? Yeah, somebody revived me. I am not very good. What's this? What is, somebody said, what is the difference between the TI and TI FTW? It depends. Um, so if you're talking about the FTW3, so the FTW3 has a few changes. It's obviously three fans. Oh, and you can get the, if it you're has, an elite member, you can get colors. Yep, if and when they're available. And it also has the ICX cooling, which has the nine thermal sensors all around the board. So you can monitor the VRM temperatures. And the fans, we've talked yeah. about it on this stream many times, but the, it really is a new way to cool the graphics card. The fans all operate independently of each other, depending on... Um, the VRM or memory temperatures. Yeah, it's zone based. Yep. Which works well for, because under the cooler, because I've taken them off, <coughs> they focus on different areas of the card. So yep. That is right. Do we expect an EJ branded vapor thing? I don't think so. Maybe you can do a vapor chamber. Yeah. Okay. Those were actually working really well. And Five, five would be on the the 480 had a vapor chamber. Yeah, it did. I don't remember if 580 did. Anymore. The 480 had to. The 480 was. definitely did. The 580, I think it may have had a vapor chamber for it. I don't think so. I think they got away with that. It was still a very hot card and required a massive power supply. More than the 750 that is on sale at Newman. Aha. See what I did? <laughs> see what I did? Yeah. See what you did. Yeah. This is still backwards, so we might have to play again. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Go. So are we almost by the end? Does anyone know? So now we need to free more prisoners. So I'm guessing at the end there's probably like a big boss fight. Oh, something's going on up here. Oh, big gun. Oh, can I take that then? Oh no! out of four prisoners. So in case you guys missed it, evj.com forward slash live giveaway, the secret word is asylum. That is for an evj Z270 FTW motherboard. <clears throat> Does that show me how many like things I've killed um whatever they are rats f1 maybe nope. Nope. Only have two bullets left the last one Good shot. I forgot. <laughs> I need the chat to remind me. Where is your health kit? Okay, that's not a good place to use in health kits. Yeah. 
Yeah, so you can actually wind up with the, the sword shot. I'm not sure. You can certainly hold it down, but it, it kind of releases automatically. Oh, okay. It just seems slow. But I'm not sure if, like, if I hold it down for longer, if it's actually, like, a more bigger hit or not. Escape through the Bridge of Shadows. That seems like the, uh, maybe that's the end. It says escape, so probably. Looks like it. Okay, we're here. Now what? We're up to 641 hot dogs. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Don't forget your ability. Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah, it's the purple bar. It's the then. F. Press F. F. To pay respects. <laughs> Victorious! There yeah. you go. There is Warheimer. So this is currently in the beta. It releases next week. It's on Steam. If you pre-order it, you get the access to the beta <coughs> for free. Woohoo! Well, I mean, obviously you got pre-order. Right yeah. So you get access to the beta. <laughs> Maybe not for free. Name of the game: Warhammer Vermintide. Side. Side. Maybe it's side or tide. Tide or side? It's not tide. I think it's side. We'll find out in a second. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I unlock stuff. That's cool. Works a strong box. Chest received. Okay. Scoreboard. There you go. How many did you get? Oh, One. whoops. Oh, I did the worst. <laughs> it was on me. <laughs> it's my fault. I will take the blame. But you know what? We won. We're a team. Mm -hmm. We all pitched in. And we won. So, what now are what's the stats? happening? Let's uh, see. Saves. Most revives. Oh, you got one revive. So, so now we're back here. Cool. Cool. So, that is. Um, so, okay. We're going to find out what it's called. Vermintide. Vermintide. So you were correct. I was <laughs> assuming too much. All right. So we got a few more minutes. So evj.com forward slash live giveaway. The secret word is asylum. For me. For hardware asylum. Mm -hmm. Dennis here. Yep. Uh, we have one more game to look at. This one just came out in early access. Okay. Look at... What is with our camera? Like, seriously. I think it's just... Oh, you know what? Is it like... No. I don't know. Oh. It's not me. Well, maybe it is. Okay, well. I fixed it. <laughs> this piece of tape on it? I don't know. It was like kind of... It was pointed that way a little oh, bit. Oh, so it was grabbing... Oh, maybe it was grabbing the wall or something? Yeah. I don't know. Okay. All right, so this is... Um, this is called Iron Maiden, and let's just do the start a new game. Come on. So this is a um. This one's cool. This is a new game. Okay, it's new. Oh, I need to show the options. I need to oh. change. I was kind of messing with this earlier. So this is a new game. It's on Steam early access it's called iron maiden it's actually um uses the build 3d engine so for any of you guys who played the old school duke new films it's the same exact game engine that those old games use so this is like a damn it Gotta find i mean it feels out. exactly like duke <laughs> <You know? laughs> it's, yeah. it's basically duke. so uh, it even has like the one liner so they did upgrade some of these sprite effects. Fire looks a lot better. So it's like you have the HD pack. Yeah. I guess. Motion's the same. It's 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 really the same. Like, mm -hmm. I like it's fast paced. Yeah. You have this one. Yeah. I mean I think you are like a security picture. I have no idea. 
So we are running it at 4K. <laughs> In case you were wondering. Hey, there's so a grenade. I got a grenade. Have a swift gun. Oh, there we go. Oh, Looks like you only have 16 bucks for a good shot. So, if you're an old school gamer like I am, I love old school games, and you definitely appreciate uh, this. It's just exactly. I don't know if it's type of thing, but you can find the key card. Wait, do I have no more? I don't have any bullets yet. What is it with me and bullets? <laughs> Where's my life? Oh, oh, I didn't even notice that. It yeah. has like the the Doom style like <laughs> face. That one probably has a more dramatic name. <laughs> Go left. This monitor is very dark. I think this is the one. Oh, there you go. There you go. Call blocked. Plan B. GDF office. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm dead. So that's it. So that is <laughs> you die. <laughs> Love it. Uh, so that is Iron Maiden, available in early access. And that's all the time we have today. Mm -hmm. So now it is time to pick a winner for this EVJ Z270 FTWK. All right, <laughs> if you died. All right, FTW for the win. Did somebody ask what it stands for? No, I just <laughs> said that. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes, for the win. Um. Oh, we made it to 675 in the SLI, so we missed. Okay. We missed the evil one. All right. We skipped right over it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm waiting till we get one three three seven. Whoever gets one three three seven will will give them a special award. Wow, that might be hard to track. Well, you just have to put look at the last person who said. Whoever's the last person before it's one three three seven gets it. But the last time we did a giveaway like this, um, everybody typed it in and you could. It was it. like phew, the chat just went like that. <laughs> <laughs> No, it has to be 1337 hot dogs. So you type exclamation hot dog into the Twitch chat, and then it will continually eat hot dogs. So whoever can get 1337 hot dogs. It's not going to happen on this stream. No. There's no way. No. Maybe in a couple of streams, perhaps. All right. So here we go. Uh, here. So now we get to test out our new method of picking winners again. Now we can, as soon as they... As soon as we select the winner, they get an email. Sweet. Which is pretty cool. Okay, the secret word was... Asylum. Asylum. All right. We go. Oh, yeah. So here's all the entries. <laughs> nice turnout, people. All right, so all I got to do is press this button, which I just did. Dude. All right, Twitch user. Twitch user EP... Is that an L or an I? I think it's an L. I can't tell. E P L C E N Z O. Twitch user E P L C E N L. I don't know. How to say. I can't mm. pronounce that. <laughs> but you have won an EBJ Z270 FTWK motherboard. Congratulations. We'll be contacting you via email right now. Watch this. EBJ Z270 FTWK. All right. All I got to do is press this button and the email goes out. With an. Oops. Yep. Let me fix that. 
that. <laughs> there. There you go. Two, not three. Bam. Boom. Sent. All right. So congratulations to uh, the winners. We had two winners, actually. Um, EPL Sinzio. And we also had Flip Flip 123 won the EVJ CLC 280. So uh, congratulations to the, all, all the winners. Thanks again, everyone, for watching. So let's talk a little about, about next week. So next week there will be there will not be a standard 3 p.m. Pacific time stream because next week we are going to be um, doing an event over in Taiwan at our game arena, um, an overclocking event. Mm -hmm. So um, we talked about it before, but when we launched the 1080 Ti King, yes, I am not great at reading names. <laughs> Will, please, I can read that one. <laughs> um, we talked about it before. Uh, when we launched the 1080 Ti Kingpin graphics card, we did a kind of like Willy Wonka style uh, giveaway where uh, winners, if you were chosen, you could, if you were the lucky winners, mm -hmm. you got a chance to overclock with Kingpin in Taiwan. So that actually is happening next week. Awesome. So we are going to be streaming during that as well. So make sure to keep an eye on the EPJ social media channels. We will be announcing the times uh, that we will be streaming because you definitely want to watch it because we will be giving away a lot of stuff <laughs> as well. Awesome. So <clears throat> well, That and the fact that you're overclocking with Kingpin, you get to learn a few of the secrets. Yeah, and you might, you might learn volunteer. something. You never yep. know. So I've been, um, so I'm going to be streaming there. Um, and I've, I've been trying to think of a game to play because PUBG mm -hmm. is like, seems like the natural game to play. But since I'm not allowed to play the game anymore, maybe, maybe I can. So maybe we can make a new rule. Okay. This is the new rule. Okay, I'm making this rule right now. <laughs> if I'm anywhere outside of California, then I'm allowed to play PUBG. There. So that means I can play it at PAX and I can play it in Taiwan. Okay, there, there. you go. Yep. There. That's the new rule. <laughs> so, <laughs> so if I'm inside California, I cannot play PUBG. But if I'm outside of California, oh. the rule doesn't apply. Awesome. Okay? I, I can go with that. All right. Good. He was the witness. <laughs> so, um... Uh, thanks again, Dennis, for yeah, for joining our stream. We'll definitely make sure to have you back again next time to uh, talk some more about hardware and gaming and overclocking. And yeah. make sure you guys check out hardwareasylum.com uh, for the latest reviews on h hardware and overclocking. Or <laughs> check out his podcast, which he does yeah. uh, bi-weekly as well. The podcast is fun. Um, and you can email us at podcast at hardwareasylum.com. You know, all the contact stuff is on the site you have any suggestions to add to the show or if you like it or hate it let me know yep all right so thanks again guys for tuning in somebody said why can't he play PUBG?" i banned <laughs> myself because i'm so bad at the game i made i made the rule last time so. right. you were yes. doing really well you got up in the ranks and you just didn't have any kills <laughs> what mic or camera you use he said sue but sue? i assume he means you so we're using a logitech uh, Brio camera. That's the 4K camera that we're looking at there. We have see. a actually. Okay, let, let's do a little 360. Before we leave, let's let's talk about some of the stuff that we have going on in here. Yeah. So we have the Logitech Brio camera. That's this one right here. Mm -hmm. We have uh, this is a Yeti Blue microphone. Blue Yeti. Blue Yeti. And then down there, under the table, we have the um, which camera is that? It's another Logitech camera. But that's the one that's pointed at the graphics card for the card cam. And then this one here is the Theta V 360 <laughs> camera. So we have one, two, three cameras. Yep. Yep. Right. And lots of lighting. I'm impressed, actually. And lots of lights. Yes. And Szechuan sauce as well. Szechuan sauce. So. And this amazing television. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Very big TV. Yeah. So uh, there you go, guys. Thanks again for tuning in. And I will see you guys next week. I don't know what time, but uh, make sure to tune into the or stay tuned to the EVJ social media channels so we can uh, let you know when that is. Cool. <laughs> if you're banned from playing PUBG in America, what makes you think? I never said <laughs> I would succeed in Taiwan. I just said that I'm allowed to play over there. All right. So, yeah. all right. It's all good. See you guys. See ya.